So I'm going to record that. Hi, uh, my name is Sergei Savastyuk. I have a PhD in applied mathematics. Today I'm going to talk about OTC stocks. It's over the counter stock trading with AI. It's primarily, I'm going to be focusing on the uh, how to find the proper signals and how navigate our website uh, with uh, uh, OTC stocks. Okay. So a few words about Tikiron. Uh, Tikiron is the SEC registered company. And uh, uh, it's important to understand that uh, if we register with SEC, then we do not sell any BS. Sometimes companies in the gray area can do that if they're not registered. Uh, so if you want to find out about registration, that's example, another company, Betterman, ADV part two. If you see uh, this form, that means the company is registered and has a, a compliance department to make sure that there is no BS advertising, okay? It's kind of important if you use other, other websites. So why you are here? Because you want to use AI algorithms and also because uh, a lot of people are gonna tell you you should be trading as robotic as possible. But that's exactly what we're doing at, uh, at this website, okay? So uh, OTC stocks, okay? I will tell you what is the OTC means. So it means over the counter. Uh, I will show you the section of the free trade signals. I'll show you the screener and the group trend analysis, okay? Now, um, what do you see? It's over-the-counter uh, stocks. Uh, it's all about the securities which are traded for the companies which are not listed on like NASDAQ, New York Stock Exchange and others. So that means they kind of have a stocks you can trade uh, but you cannot click and trade. You have to make a call and trade or go to a specific website, okay? So over-the-counter means you really have to talk a person. Uh, then you're going to be able to trade a particular stock. Typically, it is for their companies, small or overseas companies, which cannot afford to be listed. Listing these days uh, uh, is, is very expensive, okay? So let me tell you a few words how our site operates, okay? Um, this is a basic uh, trading plan development. So we have strategies of trend continued, uh, uh, trading on the deep, breakout where we study patterns, trend reversal, and that's uh, for the uh, buy direction, uh, buy stock or call or uh, by put or sell short, okay? Also trend, deep and breakout. Uh, now, it's important to understand that on our website, we do calculate million of the back testing uh, cases and present to you only those which are making sense and we do not present, which does, make, does not make sense. What it means, it means that if you wanna trade, let's say on this, uh, a dip, then we go back, uh, understand the similar, uh, not understand, kind of discover similar cases, do the back testing and say the odds of success is 75%. That's kind of main thing. Uh, also important to understand, we do not predict long-term trends. We're looking at uh, mostly uh, like in this half pipe sport, a little bit of inertia trade and get out. So let me uh, show you how it works. So this is a uh, website and let me do it even before login uh, for simplicity. I'm gonna go log out from my account, okay? And then, uh, so you see, um, I'm gonna go to uh, home. And uh, um, switch to the trader. Yep. You see, now I have uh, these uh, OTC stocks. You see, it's right here. If you want to trade penny stocks or add to the mix, then you can click right here. And now in this feed, 
you see the feed is being uh, reconfigured, uh, you're gonna get both uh, OTC stocks and penny stocks. If you add all other stocks, you can do it also. You can uh, actually transition uh, this website to the crypto website. Uh, some people do that. Uh, you see earnings calendar, everything is about the stocks. You click here and then unclick uh, these uh, two positions. And now this website is being converted to the site all about the um, uh, cryptocurrencies, okay? So now let's go back to the OTC stocks. I will unclick it. And uh, um, now what are those uh, free trade signals, okay? Uh, free trade signals uh, means that uh, these are the signals uh, which we do the back testing, we discover them and then present the odds. You see view odds, to view the odds, you have to log in, okay? So as you can see, these are the uh, different types of uh, OTC stocks. Um, then uh, you see MACD. Let's assume you don't know what this MACD is. You click right here, and then you can read about MACD. You can do like uh, paper trading, you can do reading, and you see we show pretty much everything except the odds of success, okay? So if I want to uh, view uh, odds of success, then I have to log in. I log in. Yeah, now let's read about that. Okay, you see, I'm still on OTC stocks. We're gonna load all the, uh, you see 47% view is a, a downturn, okay? Um, Mark D, 78%. Um, it is a positive, okay? So now how to get some uh, specificity of this? So what you can do, you can filter by topics. Uh, let's assume you want to get uh, technical analysis Every uh, signal has a hashtag. And then based on this uh, hashtag, I am, um, oh, so that means no technical analysis today, okay. So you can use these hashtags. Uh, let's say you want to find out about data processing companies. You click here, it's another way, and then search. Now I'm gonna extract all, uh, companies related to the data processing. And then uh, you have a 71 uh, ticker. This is a report. This is about industry highlights. And uh, you see, uh, it's also AGR. Um, and these are analysis, okay? So that's the way you can read about more stocks in the data processing services category, okay? So if you want to do more analysis, you see these are the penny stocks, what you do here, you unclick, and now you have 51 stocks only for the uh, OTC, okay? Or you can get a mix, whatever you want, really. Um, now, let's move on. Uh, you see what I wanted to show you, this is a free trade signals. Now let's move on to the screener uh, with uh, OTC. So what we do from the first page, you go to screener and search, and then screener home. Now, um, so you see it's, it's now OTC, it's a, it's a preset. And the interesting feature which we have is that um, we give a, a group 
buy and sell recommendations. You see it's a strong buy and strong sell. Um, and here it doesn't look good at all for the OTC. And in order to uh, see what is inside, you click here. And then this blue bar is uh, activated. And I'm going to click to the screener. And then I'm going to see what inside of this theme. The difference between theme and uh, uh, category is that uh, category is typically accepted by the industry. Themes are somewhat uh, smaller. Okay. So these are the all OTC stocks which been in this uh, uh, theme. Okay. And uh, that's how you can uh, get to all of them. Let me uh, show you, let's say, this example. If you want to learn more details about uh, uh, these talks, um, then, okay, let me, let me do it here first. You see, this is a buy-sell recommendation. This is a scorecard, uh, which is kind of a summary of, uh, uh, of what's going on, okay? And uh, um, then this is a fundamental analysis uh, where we have our own proprietary ratings, like for instance, valuation rating, profit versus risk, SMR, price growth. And the more green, the better. Uh, this one's kind of a lot of red we picked up. So that means there is a, a, not a lot of buying opportunities. And this is a technical analysis um, green also looks good, uh, red uh, is not. And uh, uh, <clears throat> uh, then we see that, uh, uh, that data, right? So what does it mean data? Uh, for instance, let's take that signal. Uh, that signal was today for our own indicator. If you don't remember what our own is, it's again, here is a hint. Then 56% uh, is gonna go down and the signal was today. When we read one day ago, that means that signal was yesterday and the 65% that, uh, that uh, stock is gonna go down. Uh, yeah, you always will see these contradictive messages from different indicators. So if you study them, you should know that there is not a single indicator which is going to tell you uh, for sure. So what we see here, signal was 16 days ago, but it's still on a stochastic indicator, it does uh, look uh, positive. This one looks positive. So there's a lot of kind of good signals positive on this one, okay? So now let's read more about this uh, particular company. Winner, right? Um, now we get into the so-called uh, uh, ticker page. And as you can see, uh, this is a buy recommendation. Uh, and uh, uh, whatever you've seen in the, uh, our uh, table analysis, now everything is explained in a, in, a, in a plain English, okay? So for instance, here we're exactly writing how many cases were found, what was the, uh, interesting uh, number of cases, 41 out of 50 cases were positive. That means out of stochastic indicator, you can click here and read again, if you don't know, okay? So uh, you can also view here some other headlines from other sources here in this global uh, news wire. Um, then uh, if you subscribe to the a screener, you see, you see the same type of thing I showed you in the table format, okay? You said this is a fundamental analysis, a technical analysis, and all signals which were given uh, historically uh, in, in this type of a stock, okay? So uh, this is a ticker page. Here you can type any other ticker and get this page. And that's how much we know. And I would say like, this is everything we know about this ticker. Okay, everything is in plain English, explaining technical analysis, fundamental analysis, and uh, everything related to that, okay?
Okay, let's look what else I wanted to uh, cover uh, today. Screener, okay, and then group uh, trend analysis. I, I already started from that point. As you can see, this is uh, the recommendations for the different groups. So this is themes. I can uh, click on the industries, include industries. You have more, 137 themes and uh, uh, I can exclude themes. You see 127, uh, let me see, is there anything to buy today? No. Nope, okay, that actually doesn't look good. Um, so the zero shows that it is data not received for one day because it is the over counter stock. That's the difference between, um, but in the construction material, look, it, it, it's performing really well. Um, uh, this is the gains over year, six months, one quarter, one month, and so on, okay? Um, then here in the screener, you can build the uh, different tickers. Uh, the way to do that, uh, you can go to and see how many over the counter. Uh, let me go here and click OTC. Now I uh, reset the features to kind of remove everything. And uh, I will go to the OTC. Again, let's see how many tickers uh, we cover. We cover almost 10,000 tickers, uh, in fact, okay, uh, from what you see that, that's quite a lot. In order to get uh, buy sell recommendations, you go here, you find that uh, right here, and now it's gonna be sorted strong buys, you see? This is a stocks which you strong buy. So how are we gonna get the data? You have to get this premium product um, and uh, and then see what is the phase score. It is fundamental analysis score. You get it right here. We're looking at, you see with one uh, click, you can get to fundamental analysis. You see, uh, yep. Um, this is the description. This is a technical analysis. Okay. And uh, um, and that's pretty much for every stock. Um, these are the uh, the uh, data. Okay, so price, daily volume, market cap, uh, drawdown, buy sell recommendation. This is the scores. Uh, inside the trading uh, uh, for OTC, it's kind of difficult to discover. But if there is a filing, then we report it. Uh, then the AI predictions, uh, whether or not we are giving them. Uh, and by the way, here is the opportunity to uh, do the community predictions for also OTC tickers. And by the way, we are giving these days um, for our community trend prediction rewards. So if you want to uh, get some free, um, subscriptions, you have to win right here, uh, right here. And then um, you see some people doing really well. Um, and then you can follow them. Okay. Wow, some people 100% unbelievable. Uh, quite, quite interesting. Okay. Um, so now what else? A group chain analysis, I told you. Uh, let me show you that another way of doing that. Um, so I can go to the screener. Screener home. And I will show you where to read the report on the different stocks in plain English. Okay, so always arriving to the group analysis, the industry, um, let's say construction materials, I have 67 stocks. I click here and go to the scorecards. Okay, so now I'm going to see the scorecard for pretty much every company on that list. 
You see, this is the list. The scorecard overall hold. Okay. Um, yep, it's hold. Okay. And then as, as a group analysis, and now it's all about every company which is buy, sell as the reason the group is a hold. Okay. So that's pretty much what I wanted to show you. You can also subscribe uh, to our channels uh, on Twitter. We give free trade signals in Twitter, uh, but we don't give it for what you see, unfortunately, because that would require 10,000 more tweets. Uh, and also we give it to uh, the uh, stock tweets. Okay. Uh, how to find us? Uh, you also type ticker on in stock tweets. Okay, uh, ticker on, go here. Uh, by the way, we give 1 million tweets, and then here we give like almost 500,000 uh, trade ideas here in a stock tweet. Okay, We're giving them really for free. Okay, uh, I think I'm done for today. And if you have any questions, just go ahead and ask me. Otherwise, I'm going to uh, close this uh, webcast. If you want to watch other webcasts, you can always go to the academic community and the webcasts. And then I see what um, I'm gonna talk uh, next week about the out of trading with the iRobot, okay? That's going to be interesting. That's about it, guys. If you don't have any questions, then uh, good luck and then see you next Thursday. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm.